had a really weird experience today <laughs> definitely a first um, so as I told you I'm bipolar so I take lithium which is literally the metal lithium and you have to take blood tests every quarter of a year just to make sure that you know your kidneys aren't fucked up or something so <laughs> I went to get a blood test and I needed to, to take a lot of blood because uh, there were a lot of tests I needed to do. Um, you know, most of them were kind of useless. For example, uh, <laughs> they wanted me to do a cholesterol test. So I told them, look, I'm vegan for two years. I don't consume cholesterol. <laughs> so there's really no reason I'd have high cholesterol. And they're like, no, no, but your body can overcompensate and yeah. No, don't, don't <laughs> the doctors don't only don't always know what they talk about <laughs> anyway uh, so I went to the blood test you know things as usual uh, you know I look sit down look to the other way get punctured you know as usual I don't really feel it she starts taking my blood and then I look at it which is actually a first first time I look at it but I know that, you know, I, they always take a bit of blood. <laughs> but this time, she had like a whole vial, like this big, and started filling it up. I'm like, okay, <laughs> you sure you're not taking too much? She's like, no, no, it's fine. I'm like, uh, I feel like you're bleeding me dry. And what happened was I started getting really uh, shocked. Um, it's kind of a shock that I didn't feel in many, many years. Like when you look at something, you know, so horrible that your body shuts down. And I literally, uh, you know, I finished it and I felt like I was in, in shock. I told her like, you know, I, I need to, yeah, I'm in, I'm in shock. <laughs> That's what I said. And I think I'm in shock and I'm, I'm really, really, really in shock. And she, she said, are you okay? I was like, yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll just get up and sit outside so the other person can actually come in and also get their blood taken. And she's like, no, no, sit. So I sat down and from the moment I sat down, maybe five seconds later, blackout. <laughs> like I was, I was in La La Land at that point. And I just, I was in, uh, I don't know if I'd call it a dream, but I wasn't there. <laughs> and then I opened my eyes and it felt like, I felt like a computer uh, that got, you know, restarted. Like everything was just booting up for the first time. It was the weirdest thing, feeling. I felt like, I felt like I, 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 I didn't know who I was. <laughs> it's like I opened my eyes and I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, I, like, I felt like I, I was born, like I was in another reality, but I knew. It's like I knew I was in another, re like, I opened my eyes, I was like, I knew it. It's not even the real reality. This is the real reality. And <laughs> it took me like five, ten seconds to really kind of catch myself together. And everybody's like, oh my god. I have like five, six people around me, like two doctors and three nurses, four nurses. And I was like, I opened my eyes and when I got it together, I was like, that was awesome. <laughs> I just started laughing and they're like, you fainted. I'm like, I know it's my first time. Holy shit. That's so cool. And they're like, oh my God, he's in shock. And I'm like, no, no, I'm not in shock. And I'm like laughing, really, it's really funny to me. They're like, oh my God, something is wrong with him. Why is he laughing? Because <laughs> most people are like, you know, I was in shock. I, I, I passed out. No. And, I'm, and I, I took it as a joke. And they're like, you have to sit. Don't move. Don't, don't put your head down. Don't lift your head up. And I'm like, no, I feel fine because I did. I felt perfect. So I, um, I just got up and started dancing. Oh God, it was such a weird experience.
Sorry for the wind. Um, so yeah, it was a really, really funny experience. Um, first time in my life. Uh, there were plenty of first things that happened in my life uh, this year, but this definitely wasn't one I was expecting. But um, I got a cool lesson out of it. I learned that, you know, uh, don't pay attention to the things you you don't like <laughs> or afraid of. Like if there's something in your life that scares you, that makes you anxious, that, you know, just, you just don't, just doesn't make you feel good, don't pay attention to it. Now, I know this sounds like, avoid your fears no no <laughs> but you know how there's fears that you kind of know you want to face and they're really like you know it's a positive thing it's a fear it's called a you stress like it scares you but you it's a good kind of fear and then there's all the rest <laughs> you know you're scared about this cares about that well either face it full on or fucking, you know, don't even look at it, just push forward and keep moving. But don't be halfway like I was. <laughs> Cause I wasn't I wasn't like, okay, uh, I'm gonna face the fear, face the blood, you know. I was like, uh how does it look? Uh, uh, uh? Bad. <laughs> uh but yeah, I mean I I'm just kind of gleaming a a lesson out of it, but this is more of a funny experience than an educational one for me so uh, this is my first video where there's no lesson <laughs> just a funny story hope you like it let me know what you think let me know if it happened to you talk soon